healthcare is just not physical. Um, it's physical, social, uh, financial, and, and your ethnic backgrounds and your um, religious backgrounds, your, your language preference uh, play a huge role in what you understand and, uh, and comprehend of a disease. And if somebody can explain what's going on with you uh, in your own language using um, stories from your own culture or background or your own religion, can have a huge impact in the patient outcomes. My name is Yosef Farouk, and I am the director of the school. How I got linked up with San Diego Housing Commission, um, I have to say thank you to Jonathan Arevalo, who was my contact, uh, uh, and he got my our contact information from International Rescue Committee, who we have worked with for many years at this point, and uh, he reached out to me, and, um, and that was a few years back now, and we have had a very great working relationship since then. The two main programs that we help San Diego Housing students with is our Certified Nursing Assistant Program and also our Medical Assistant Program. What this training does for our students is it not only helps the student, it helps our community. A good example is El Cajon is sort of a center of nursing homes and when we placed our school here uh, was for a reason because we knew that once we had students we could send them out to these nursing homes to, to really help and, and do their externships and also help out um, in disaster times like COVID for example. Our students were going out to these nursing homes as, as additional help. When I first started the school, my idea of success was even if I can help one student get a license and they're working in the field, I feel successful. Over the past 12 years now that we have had the school and hundreds, hundreds of students that have come out of the school, um, my concept of success has been changing over time. Today, um, success means that we have not only helped the student, we helped our community, uh, we helped the patients at the end of that, you know, uh, interaction that the students are having. One of the things that I'm very proud of is the fact that our students are multilingual, multicultural, and from multiple ethnic backgrounds. 